Hi, we're the Two Dudes. From the Two Dudes Drinking Podcast. That's Sean. That's Luke. And this is episode... 55. Elastic Penis. Enjoy. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Two, two dudes, dudes drinking. Drink, drink, drink a lot of beer. beer. Game on. Good afternoon. Today on a very special Two Dudes Drinking, Sean is taking a pee. Right now, at this very moment, Sean is outside, expelling water from the end of his penis. Believe it or not, folks, this is something that he actually does quite often and is quite a problem. Because he has a tiny little bladder. (laughs) That can't hold in a man's amount of beer. And he won't know about that until he listens to this episode. And here he is. Sean himself. I have returned. And he had a wiener in his hand. It was me own. I had my own cock in my hand. Because I had to go pay. <laughs> Were you playing with your cock all day? <laughs> Hoping that no one looks away. Come on, somebody look, somebody look at it. <laughs> Anybody? <laughs> hey, look, I can do tricks. Ow! <laughs> it's a dog now. <laughs> Pup tree of the penis. <laughs> no, the name was, of the episode? No, it was on Howard Stern. Oh! Years ago. Oh. Uh, apparently it's still a thing, but a guy did... Basically balloon animals with his dick. Oh, my God. How uh, big is that dick? Uh, I'm guessing pretty substantial, but it would also have to be uh, a little stretchy. Mm. <laughs> I mean, mine's got some stretch, but <laughs> Very not elastic penis. You never know. Everybody's That's got their That's the name some of the episode. <laughs> elastic penis. <laughs> <laughs> That'll get their attention. <laughs> oh, my God. What are they talking about now? <laughs> um, so we are very pressed for time on this episode. Uh, yes, please, Sean. Okay. Sean just offered me a, uh, <laughs> a ice beer cold, that you paid for. <laughs> an ice cold American Pilsner. Um, yeah. Man, that kind of hurt my finger when I did. Man, I swear to God, I'm falling apart. Uh, Little shit. I dinged my back of my hand on that fence at the football game. Oh, yeah. Still fucking hurts. Well, we are in our 30s. Right. Uh, while Sean's getting the beer, we went to Sean's nephew's football game. And, uh,. First of all, it's weird to see, like, uh, we're going to introduce the cheerleaders, and they're like, woo, and then I'm like, god damn it, that's my friend's daughter. Like, just, we feel old, and we're like, our friends have kids, and we have, shit, I have a kid in high school. Yeah, that's fucking crazy. Right? I have a kid who's a sophomore in high school. Um, It's it's crazy to think about how how old these kids are i know she's gonna be barking at me for gas money within a year like i've got a picture of me and ian from when he was yeah right so ian one is almost ian's uh sean's nephew like he's got to be close to uh learner's permit right yeah i, I think he's uh, yeah he has it he has it. jesus <laughs> anyway it was uh, ian and cam sean's little nephew little they're not little yeah they're his nephews they're still sore, and uh, so they're little. Yeah. Anyway, but it's just, man, I feel old at those games now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's crazy, man. Yeah. Crazy, Why man. Did... Well, I'll tell you what. The time just flies by, and then you realize <laughs> you go what was it? You go out for coffee, and then you... <laughs> you go out for coffee, and then you know, 52 years goes by. <laughs> <laughs> did you text me that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, no, it was from the Bruce Campbell book. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> you go out for coffee and listen. Oh, I went out for coffee when I was 21, and when I got back, I was 58. <sighs> Two more years. <laughs> We're 58. Oh, didn't you say who's coming up on 60? Michelle Pfeiffer soon. October. Uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> she's coming up. I think we have a still have like a year. Uh, oh God damn it. Um, Fran Drescher, she's the 30th of this month. Oh, okay. Yeah. Really? Then, <laughs> Bruce Campbell's coming up, too. Uh, ooh. Not, not that I'm into fellas or anything, but right. no, it's Bruce Campbell. Um, we are uh, trying to get our wives on to do a Dudes Over 60 <laughs> yeah. episode, you know, to show that we're... Yeah, we're equal know. opportunity perverts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. 
<laughs> I'd look at some Bruce butt. <laughs> Does it have a uh, like a? Do they say like, oh, his butt's got a people chin <laughs> or a face chin or something? <laughs> look like a tail? <laughs> I don't know. Um, shit. <laughs> Oh, fuck. I was going to uh, say something, but I totally got off track. What were we talking about before that? I don't remember. Oh, getting old. <laughs> Speaking of getting old. <laughs> <laughs> I still can't remember what the hell we were talking about. Really, my finger, I knocked on to make that dick sound, and my my finger's a little bit swollen. <laughs> Aw. No, it's fine. Poor fella. Probably going to die. Hmm. Remember yeah. when I told Lane I was going to die? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, tune in to... Uh, what episode was that? 16? Yeah, it was a long... T- I mean, honestly, it wasn't that long ago. But we, it, well, since we started staying on top yeah, of it. Yeah, since we started kind of getting more but professional. But it feels like it. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I convinced Lane I was going to die. And I was like, I'm just kidding. He's like, I was about to cry. <laughs> <laughs> I told oh, him I had ass cancer. <laughs> yeah. I do have It was because you're... Yeah. All seven colitis. <laughs> it's unpredictable. <laughs> I just, I just shit myself. Uh, that was Sean's uh, song, I Just Shit Myself, which can be found on our YouTube channel. <laughs> YouTube. Uh, anyway, it's a good by song. the way, we do have a YouTube channel, so go to yeah. it and watch it. <laughs> Dustin, Yogi, Benjamin. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and like, we, it's just for views. We can't make any money off of it because it's other people's shit because mm-hmm. it's parodies. Yeah. Um, so, But like, hey. You want to give the four tops some money? Go play our shit. Yeah, God. Man, this parody shit's getting getting out of hand. <laughs> I know. We should start playing our own, and then we can charge ourselves for it. Yeah. Yeah, because our channel's monetized, but only certain videos are. Mm-hmm. And, like, it'll be like, hey, don't make a claim, don't make a claim. Shit, they made a claim. <laughs> like, can't do that one. Anyway. Um, the uh, So we're going to, uh, you know, we talked about that. We're, we just feel fucking old. Yeah, it's crazy. Um, so I have, I have no lead in. So we're going to talk about uh, our main subject is, uh, <laughs> I the, need one more. <laughs> the, I'll, I'll talk real slow. So can, um, do you need to go look at your record collection just to find one? Well, we're going to do our, uh, oh, fucking duh. I'll bet your fucking does my fucking duh. Okay. Uh, I'm good. Cause I had a fucking duh. That was my number two. <laughs> that I was like, I can't believe I forgot that. Uh, by the way, what we're talking about is <laughs> we're going to do top Parodies. five <laughs> front men. <laughs> um, and this is like rock and roll front men, heavy metal front men. Just like when we say front men, we don't mean like talented singer or whatever. We're talking like the guy who got in front of the band and just grabbed you by your balls and said, listen, dude, we're going to rock you <laughs> and your balls as well. <laughs> oh, yeah. I guess I should let go of them. This is getting awkward. There you go. Well, it all depends on. Right. <laughs> <laughs> um, so anyway, without further ado. Without further ado. Oh, they, they've made two appearances. <laughs> appearances. <laughs> appearances. Oh, appearances. My sister made a two periods and then no more. Then the nine months later, the baby. <laughs> it was cute. <laughs> we named her Bjork. <laughs> We're very sorry. <laughs> we we didn't mean to unleash her around the world. She's very strange. Make lots of money, though. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, <laughs> I remember something I was going to say. Did we put Cindy Lauper on the list? Yeah, I think she's on there. Okay. Can I tell you something? You don't have a choice. I'm going to tell you anyway. Yeah, no. So <laughs> it's very sad, but sometimes when I'm bored, I get oh, on God, our did YouTube. Did she die? No. I get on our YouTube channel and I watch our, <laughs> our videos. She's going to now. <laughs> I, wa- I get on our YouTube channel and watch our parody videos because I'm just like, these are funny. Yeah. yeah. Like, it, they're funny. And, and they I are. Just, I, I like them. I do too. I should go on my... Uh, That's a great picture, by the way. Which Sydney Lauper. Oh, gee, the Ghostbusters. <laughs> yeah, go, go on. So one of our videos we did was a we did a parody of Cindy Lauper's Time After Time, and we did Slime After Slime as Ghostbusters. Mm. And I was like, man, I probably haven't seen that video since I was like fucking six years old. Uh-huh. So I watched the Cindy Lauper video for Time After Time, and like it's charming and stuff. And like she was always, I was kind of had a little crush on her when I was little because oh, she was yeah. weird. Mm-hmm. You know, oh, she's yeah. so unusual. It's the title of. One of her albums. 
It's not unusual to be loved by anyone. Don't sick that guy on her. She will die. <laughs> yeah. She's getting paled. I love that song. Anyway. <laughs> Poor Elvira. Oh, yeah. Giddy up. What is that right? Giddy up some stitches, some stitches. Oh, come vagina. On. Anyway. Um, vagina. <laughs> <laughs> the, <laughs> I went down a rabbit hole of Cindy Lauper videos and like they're so 80s ridiculous. Oh, like, yeah. It started out with time after time and it was like you know her her old pal that they worked there he she worked in a store and then they went out and partied and then she got her hair cut and he was mad at her and then she decided to leave and but it's all told in the story of a song. Oh. It's a different time. They didn't just put tits in front of a camera and say I'm talented. <laughs> Haters gonna hate, hate, hate. <laughs> oh, fuck that. Yeah. Fuck Taylor Swift. Um, the, uh... I don't have time. <laughs> <laughs> or a way to get past security. <laughs> um, Not like... Hey, then, no, she, no. then her next song would be called, be called Sean. <laughs> <laughs> if only it was as easy as The Simpsons. Potato Man. <laughs> <laughs> but um shit what ones did i i did that one and then uh-huh. uh true colors funny story it gave me you ever get little flashbacks from your childhood where something just goes Whoo! oh yeah i remembered at the end of true colors she's like nude from the waist up and she's leaning into a reflection and it's like singing into it i remember when i was a kid me and my brother were like Ew, she's naked. Gross. And now I'm like, ew. She's... <laughs> but, but now I'm like, ooh, she's naked. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> um, however, mm-hmm. one that I wanted to specifically tell you about, like after I take off, you need to watch Goonies Are Good Enough, parts one and two. <laughs> All right. <laughs> um, it tells a story of Cindy Lauper and her family who run a gas station mm. getting uh, run out of town by Iron Sheik. Um, oh, yeah, because she hung out with a, they did a whole thing of, with wrestling back in the day. Yeah. Yeah. And, and it's Captain, like Captain Lou. I'll, I'll Captain Lou, pay, he plays I'll her live. dad. Yeah. Um, he also plays her dad in uh, Girls Just Want to Have Fun. He <laughs> goes, what you gonna do with now, <laughs> Like that guy. <laughs> he also played Mario in the Super Mario Brothers Super Show. Oh, right. <laughs> Man, he died recently, didn't he? Oh, he's been dead for a while. Oh, good. But- I mean, not good. <laughs> 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 oh, so, but what a Oh, me. good. Glad he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Go fuck yourself, Lou. Have you ever seen Dead Wrestler Beach? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> No. I'll send it to you. Um, so, <laughs> anyway, the, you got to watch that. Like, it was so. I watched the whole thing, and I was like, "What the hell am I watching?" It's got the kids from the Goonies in it, and it's like they're Fuck. it's like they're on the they shoot some of the video like on the Goonies sets, mm. but it's not lit properly, and you can see just how shitty it all was. Like, <laughs> it does show you a little bit of the movie magic, and like funny, the you know, ugly woman who who was in Throw Mama from the Train, <laughs> <laughs> Mama Fratelli. <laughs> <laughs> what? Anyway, so hot. Uh, so yeah, so hot. And that reminded me. I was like, "Is she on this?" Because then I googled her and I was like, "She's still an attractive lady, oh, yeah. <laughs> even though a bird shit in her mouth." <laughs> <laughs> I'm not German. Well, I am part German, so never mind. I guess I'm into that. Oh, the bird shits in <laughs> her mouth. Oh, I think a little bit of blood will rush out to my penis. <laughs> you sound more like a Scandinavian. <laughs> Well, I'm a, on my mother's side. <laughs> my mother's side is a German. My you father's side. Like German Kermit. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Zeke Heil. <laughs> yes, yes. Um, no, we do. We do not affiliate with uh, that group. Yes, yes. Uh, but uh, <laughs> You guys don't even want to know. I think I can assume what yeah. I said or um, what I did. Uh, yes, so um, I am a frog. I live in uh, Germany. I live on a Sesame <laughs> Street. <laughs> um, but not anymore because Disney bought it. Uh, yeah. So now I just live in a swamp. Uh, and I play my... Um, what do Germans play? Oh, fucking... I, I, I play my synthesizers. I play my tuba. <laughs> 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 
Pom, pom, pom. How many? <laughs> Why are there so many? <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna, but I was like, no. <laughs> yeah. Let's just move on. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to just play the jingle again. <laughs> I know we already did, but got to cleanse that palate. <laughs> Uh, we paused a second so Sean could show me the video for Dead Wrestler Beach, yeah. the animation. It's kind of old by this point. Yeah. It, it's funny and horrible, I'm, uh, but it's a good song. It's funny. I'm going to start putting... Sean always sends me his links to these videos, <laughs> and like I'll <laughs> send him shit. stuff. I think I'm going to start putting them on the Two Dudes Drinking Facebook page like just to share a little insight into what the fuck me and Sean do yeah. in our spare time. <laughs> Um, um, so anyway, I'm going to do that. But uh, yeah, we're we're going to talk about the uh, top five front men. So. Yes. Oh, Back on track. Front, front person. Oh, we're going to talk about the top five front people. because Front some, people. There could be some women on this list. There's not. <laughs> um, <laughs> How many on. do you have? <laughs> I have zero women on my list. Uh, I have what? zero women on my list. <laughs> I have one kind of gender bender on there. Oh, two, actually. <laughs> two. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, do you want to go first? You and me, too. Um, you went first last time. Okay, you go yeah. ahead. Uh, first on my list is a, a rather new to the mainstream hmm. uh, Papa Emeritus. Um, the uh, singer, I mean, basically the guy uh, for uh, Ghost, the band Ghost, or Ghost B.C., um, mm-hmm. uh, he's only not higher on my list because the rest of my list is better front men, mm-hmm. but, um, he's getting up there and puts on a damn good show and like, he's kind of the creative force behind ghost and whoever, if you're not into him, check them out. They're kind of like a, <laughs> they're like a very tongue in cheek, uh, mm-hmm. like satanic prog rock band. <laughs> and like, <laughs> it's, if you will look at their shit on YouTube and stuff, they have such a sense of humor about it. Yeah. And, uh, but also just talented, talented motherfuckers. It, it pisses me off that he, that he shows his face now. They don't do it a lot. Well, I but mean, I, just cause that one picture got out and he's like, oh, here it is. Yeah. It's still kind of like, there's only so long that could last. No, right here. Spoiler. Gotcha. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> I'm all covered in didgeridoo. <laughs> I guess that'd be semen, wouldn't it? Didgeridoo? Yeah. <laughs> like dog semen? <laughs> anyway, uh, but... Uh, no, that's a dingo. <laughs> I'm going to play this little clip that they posted on their... Or there, somebody posted. Uh, so we played that thing from Freddie Mercury doing the like... From doing with the crowd. Well, you can tell that Papa Emeritus, the front man for Ghost, has a little... Papa Smurf? I don't remember what he sounds like. Um, that, uh, he has a little influence there, but I'm going to play this little, this little guy here. (laughs) Motherfucker. (laughs) (laughs) Hang on, hang on. Technology. Okay, it'll play this time. telling you it's like what Freddie Mercury did but in a minor thing. Yeah. Because they're spooky. <laughs> anyway, fun stuff. Yeah. Um, stuff. So yeah, he's my my number one. Or my number five. Uh, yeah. I like okay. the guy. Check the band out. My number five. Oh, sorry. <laughs> are, are you good? Yeah. Okay, my number five. I, I it clicked and I split it last second. Uh, <laughs> Dave Brocky slash Odorous Urungus. I'm shocked that was your last second. I figured it'd just be on there. It's just I I don't know. I just forgot. <clears throat> but if just you like haven't he forgotten not to do heroin. Oh yeah. I know, I know. I know. He's been. Well, we should be respectful to drugs. <laughs> don't do drugs. Well, it all depends on the drug. 
as we're drinking beer. Don't do heroin. <laughs> and handle <Yeah>. your beer. <laughs> Moderation, folks. Just do a little heroin. Anyway, uh, if you've seen Guar Live, you understand what I'm talking about. If you haven't, go look up the old videos of shit him do. Uh, I was in their doing. presence live. Didn't watch. You didn't watch? No, I was fucking angry. I was angry, but at the same time, I was like, never seen Guar for free. I, I leaned over the rail a couple times. I, I was fucking mad. Yeah. For, I think we've talked about it before, but we were set to open. What's that noise? I don't know. But, but, anyway. but we were set to open for Guar, and we got yeah. bumped at the last minute because their tour manager wasn't happy with how the sound system set up. Yeah. And that shit takes time to reset. So they said, we'll start late. Bump the opener. And we were like, you son of a bitch. Yeah. You half bastard. Anyway, anyway. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, Dave Brocky. Nice. Odorous Urungus. Um, next on my list would be uh, Marilyn Manson. Closest thing to a woman on my list. <laughs> uh, just, I don't know. I've always been into the shock rockers. Uh, Alice Cooper was the first one I got into. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. Some of the '80s guys I thought mm-hmm. were pretty cool. Mm-hmm. And uh, but uh, yeah. I, I was, it, I don't know, I was just kind of drawn, drawn to the, <laughs> drawn to the theatrics of it. Music's pretty cool. Mm. Uh, my opinion's still, still solid, mm. though, uh, <clears throat> definitely aging. Mm. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's my, it's next on my list. The Merlin Munson. <laughs> he got fat. <laughs> then he got skinny. <laughs> I think he's fat. Now he's just old. <laughs> <laughs> What's uh, your next one? My number four, love him or hate him. Bill Anselmo. It's next on my list as well. <laughs> For good. Yeah. Because <laughs> his own words, I can... I By the can... way, before you do that, mm-hmm. let me go ahead and tell everybody, Sean does a really good fucking fill. Thank you. <laughs> yep. Okay, go ahead. And action. <laughs> now you put me on the spot. Now I'm going to fuck you. I'm feeling so much. I can make people get on the ground and have have an orgy. Yeah, I, I can make the ground split open and you know have everybody jump inside. And <laughs> don't underestimate the kid because I am the fucking kid. Is that good? <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> Tell us about your back surgeries. I've had the most major back surgery in the history of back surgeries. I dropped my wedding ring. <laughs> <laughs> that means you're no longer married. Hmm. Nothing? Great. Now you're not laughing. It just makes me look gay as shit. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Found it. <laughs> Found it. <laughs> I was going to say, was that yours? <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. yeah it's <laughs> long gone. Anyway. Uh, 12 bucks on Amazon. <laughs> Tungsten. Uh, yeah, I... Uh, Tungsten. So, it's like you said, love him or hate him. Mm. one of the best heavy metal front men of all time. Oh, yeah. He really knew how to get a crowd going. One thing, I was at one of their shows, and that I fucking loved was he's doing his little thing. And don't get, he had a lot of bravado between songs. Oh, yeah. And, but man, there was one time that what he said, I'm like, yeah, fuck you fucking posers. He goes, I see you all back there. You're just standing there like this. And he like crosses his arms and like mm. does the thing. Uh-huh. And he's like, "You think you're too good to fucking dance and get in the mosh pit, and you just want to look cool and bond your head?" He's like, "Fucking move around! It's a goddamn rock show!" And like, it's a goddamn rock show. Um, yeah, you do it better than I do. <laughs> um, you got fucking upstage me, <laughs> or you got to up, up table me. <laughs> well, I can only do the low voice though. I can't do the high one. Um, <laughs> Gates! See, you got me beat. <laughs> yeah, go. but he can't do it. Anymore. <laughs> he can't do it anymore either. That's true. <laughs> go on. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, that stuck with me. So I try to look like I'm enjoying myself in a lot of shows. Yeah. If I'm gonna not, I'll just go in the back and have a drink or whatever. You know, mind my business. But those people that like go and stand in the pit and whatever, and then you're just like cross your arms. Yeah. You see me. <laughs> like I, I, I loved that. Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, I was going to add some of that, but it's gone. It's gone. Um, Well, that was my next one. Uh, You go ahead and do your next one. My next one, my number three, is a... Wait. One, two, three. 
That was my three. Phil was my three. Okay, yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, <laughs> my next one is yeah! what? James Hetfield. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, I almost put him on there. Uh-huh. But like, I almost. I don't think you can do it so much now. Oh, honorable mention: David Lee Roth. <laughs> oh yeah! Oh man! Yeah, um, that's a good one. I, I don't think he, he's yeah, more you, toned down nowadays because he's like you know we're the family. We're the, he's all happy and loving life. It's because he stopped drinking and got healthy and started taking care of himself. It's that fake. son of a bitch! It's fake. <laughs> you can pretend you're happy all you want, but you know what? Happiness doesn't. Go- Hold on. <laughs> because the happiness doesn't come from a plant, but eh, maybe it does. Yes. Did he go vegetarian? No. Oh. I eat cars. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, I agree. It's see, I was I was on like, yeah, he's a singer, but since he plays the guitar, is, is he still like front manny? Mm. But he does still like lead the show. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I was like, ah, that's where some of these guys beat him out on my list. Mm. But I totally agree. He's... Or beat him off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> beat me off. <laughs> anyway, go. <laughs> beat me off. <laughs> you want to see my goo. Squirt. Spooch, spooch. It goes on. Spooch. Go on. We'll have to do Metallica sexy songs. Yeah. Yes. I think um, we did. Did we mention that? Like, I think we did. Are you sure? Because I'm pretty sure we did. I, I thought I would do a so, uh, like, anyway. Like, <laughs> told her to grab the vibrators, but didn't have any batteries. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care if we ever did it. We'll do it again. Yeah, maybe we didn't. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, you you done with? You done with James? Yeah, I'm done with James. You can have him. <laughs> um, next on my list, which <laughs> it's number two, right? He's filthy. We're on number two. Uh, wow, that went fast. Yeah. Uh, good. <laughs> um, <laughs> next on my list, which I'm guessing is your number two. I'm guessing our two and one are the same. Uh, we it? know what our number one is, but oh, number yeah. two, uh, my uh, Ozzy Osbourne. No, he's not on your list. I bumped him for Dave Brocky. Wow. No disrespect. No disrespect. No disrespect. No disrespect. But it's Dave Brocky. I, I think I'm a bigger. It's your list. I'm a bigger Guar fan than Ozzy fan. I love Ozzy. Oh, I mean, you could wonder. What the fucking James Hetfield. You could me? wonder why Sean made that decision. Don't ask well, me. I don't know. At the same time, if you're going, come on. Wait, what? Come on. I missed what? Damn it. <laughs> no. You got to re-listen to this, yeah, and you'll find that joke you missed. <laughs> Damn it, that was good. Damn it, um, <sighs> good dog. Well, I, <sighs> dog. is Ozzy a really good fart man, though? Yes. Okay, you know, you say your piece. Uh, I was just about have to shit ever, all over the next one. You're like, have you ever Go seen fucking him? crazy? When yes, I've seen him live. Yes, and he does his little jump, and he gets <laughs> like six inches of air, and, and he walks. Like, <laughs> to, to the right side of the stage, and then to and the he, left, and side then he of sticks the stage. his arm up like you make noise, <laughs> and he goes to the other side and he's like you know, and dude, it's I at that age words, with so that much drugs, drugs that have been put in his life, and he still pulls it off. But also, look at those videos back in the Black Sabbath days, and back to the whole thing from last episode, Fair Bill enough. Ward. Mm. I'm not talking about still today, like nowadays, Ozzy still would have made my list. Yeah, but like, dude. The 60s through, I'd say, 80s and early 90s was, like, um, maybe up to, like, No More Tears. Yeah. Um, well, maybe even past that. Probably. Mm. What was after No More Tears? Was, uh. Shit. See, that's what happens when you, when you get old, people ask you questions, and it's the easy answers that were like, what? <laughs> yeah. Keep talking. Uh, anyway. Uh. Go look at his shit he did in the 60s and 70s with Black Sabbath, and you're like, again, flower children, disco, all that bullshit. And what Black Sabbath was doing, what Ozzy was bringing to the table, it's fucking amazing. And just so out of this world. And then uh, when uh, he went solo, 
And him and Randy Roods made fucking magic. Mm-hmm. That's uh, that's all I have to say about that. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, it's it's not in fucking order for some reason. Anyway, fuck you, Google. What's your number two? Boop. <laughs> <laughs> My number two is Bruce Dickinson. Motherfucker. See why I left Ozzy off my list? <laughs> Man. <sighs> Man, I would have almost bumped Marilyn Manson for Bruce Dickinson. Mm-hmm. If it wasn't for, like, my personal yeah. preferences. Scream for me, Santiago! <laughs> and, I don't have the voice for Yeah, him. I hear you. And, man, he pulls off them short shorts. Yes, he does. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Not literally. Yeah. Although, Nico is funnier. But, yeah, Bruce is one hell of a front man. I wouldn't fuck with any of those guys. You know they can beat our asses, even oh, at yeah. their age. Yeah. They're on the list. <laughs> They're in shape. Yes, We're not. sir, you're on the list. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not on the list. Put me on your list. <laughs> you're on it. <laughs> <laughs> I can't really think of what Nico sounds like, so I'm just going to do this voice for him. I think that might be close. You ever watch Game of Thrones? No. Shit. There's a character on there called Braun for anybody who watches it. I got ribs in Florida. I always picture that's what... <laughs> Uh, Nico McBrain sounds like you see the, he says the this. word Conta. oh wait we've heard his voice uh, <laughs> message from Harry oh, yeah. <laughs> hey made me fuck anyway but yeah uh, uh, Bruce Dickinson yeah god damn it's good what a powerful <laughs> voice that guy has yeah, you did your number two right shit I just remembered an honorable mention uh, yeah, Ozzy I, was my number two. Yeah, but I threw in Dave, Diamond Dave, so go ahead. Yeah, but I want to make sure it's not your number one. I think we... <laughs> can, we can we do our number one now yeah, just we'll to make do sure? we'll do the number one first. It, okay. Right after we this? say it, remember, it's one, two, three, four, go. Okay. One, two, three, Wait, uh, <laughs> a one. A one, two, one, two three, four. Freddie, Freddie Mercury. <laughs> Dio. Oh, yeah, fucking Dio, duh. Right? That's... <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we could have done a top ten. Right. Anyway, Freddie. Yeah. Freddie Mercury is he is the best front Freddy man that Freddy! has ever lived. Uh, food, food. Untouchable. Untouchable well, hands. Down. <laughs> well <laughs> um. Uncurable. Uncurable. Oh, oh. Oh. I know that was a little far, but what's he gonna do? <laughs> With all that junk, all that Junk inside his truck. Get, <laughs> <laughs> get, 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 eight. <laughs> uh, oh, do we take that out? <laughs> we'll listen no. back. Uh, yeah. I, was, I think it's <laughs> the fact of the shame that you feel right now. <laughs> yeah, I feel pretty horrible because I do love that guy. Not like that. Because <laughs> I was like seven. <laughs> do you put condoms on your ears when you listen? Just, <laughs> just to be safe. <laughs> anyway. Where to come uh, right now? Go ahead, say your <laughs> <laughs> say your piece. Uh, well, I mean, just again, live at Wembley, uh, just all the shit that he was able to do with that massive amount of fucking people, or the Live Aid when they stole the fucking show. I mean, yeah, Queen's still a huge band, <laughs> but Live Aid. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Yeah, they're still a, a you know huge band, but man, nobody nobody will ever have that fucking right. power that he had. Uh, he had a voice, um, and I think I've talked about him here before. If not, we've talked about it. But how the whole thing, like his teeth were kind of jacked, but he left yeah, them because he, had... he thought how they were positioned helped him project his voice more. Yeah, and didn't he? I, I think I heard. Yeah, it was on that documentary. He had like extra teeth. I think I remember. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, no, let's not go down this far. Anyway, I already, big T. I already said something horrible. I'm yeah, going to stop yeah. right there. <laughs> uh, but yeah, just, I do feel really bad about that, just so you know, <laughs> listeners. See, now we can't cut it because we're now we're narrating what you just said. Yeah. You're, AIDS! <laughs> you, you're stuck. <laughs> well, I didn't give it to him. Dude, so. <laughs> we were in a band that had a song called AIDS. I you think know, you're past, right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, it's probably on our MySpace. I don't know. Those, that still exists. <laughs> my space. We have thousands of plays. <laughs> Neat. I'm sure we have some messages. You guys want to play a show? <laughs> Crickets. <laughs> Baddest one. I, I don't know. <laughs> hey, Joe. Joseph, <laughs> if you listen. Yeah, he doesn't. Uh, we, 
We keep in touch on Facebook. That's actually. not the Joe I was looking for last episode. No, no, no. <laughs> well, that's Joseph. Yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, Freddie Mercury, he's, I mean, he's one of the first front men I was introduced to, like, musically. Um, watching videos and stuff, and, like, we've all seen, it's, when he's singing, I always picture, like, We Are the Champions, but where he's got the microphone, and he's singing to it, and his other hand is, like, just in a fist to the crowd, just like, rah, 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 rah. Yeah. like, and it's just, like, fist pumping, uh, like, power, oh, yeah. power pose. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm, John? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm talking about in concert, not in the bedroom. <laughs> oh. Oh, you lost me. <laughs> Freddie Mercury. <laughs> no, no. Anyway, continue. Anyway, good stuff. Yeah. Say your piece. Good stuff. Uh, my piece is... <sighs> all these fucking dildos nowadays who try to fucking... <laughs> <laughs> who try to be like... It, there will never be another... No. That will have that much fucking power. No. You, you can get Bieber pack at fucking stadiums, but he's still a fucking... He can't do it. Nobody could fucking do what Freddie Mercury did. He's still a tiny Hands little douchebag. And everybody respects him. Yes. He's the guy that could walk out with a uh, queen's crown, literally, and a goddamn velour cape. Yep. With little fringe and fur. <laughs> and we'd all go, God damn, that's one cool motherfucker. Well, hold on. There was one other person who did that. Macho Man Randy Savage. Yeah, but the thing is, he was playing a character. Fair enough. Whereas Freddy was just like, <laughs> this is this is what I wore to church, love. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck did you just say? <laughs> I don't need to repeat myself, <laughs> Freddie Mercury. Church love. <laughs> <laughs> My apologies, but I say what I want. <laughs> <laughs> I need to work on that. <laughs> yeah. Know what I mean? Our Liverpool accent's okay. <laughs> Oh, very much locked queen. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm sorry. I, I fucked up his accent. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just do Ernest? Ur- <laughs> Did you just do fucking <laughs> Ernest P. Whirl? <laughs> Freddie Mercury? <laughs> <laughs> My apologies, but I say what I want. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> he said that in Wembley. You know what I mean, Brian? <laughs> <laughs> when he, when he, he actually went, they're talking through here. <laughs> I bet they are. <laughs> uh, I got to pee so bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, you want to take a little pee break and then we'll do some parodies? Yeah. All right. Doing pee breaks. Sean's going to pull out my lizard. Gonna <laughs> squirt some goo. Wait. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm going to play the... Go pee. I'm going to play okay. the thing. All right. We're going to do some parodies. Oh, wait. No. Doing parodies. <laughs> what Sorry. a way to be some lord. Cheeks. They really don't like it. Ooh. There is just one thing. Dicks. <laughs> this is just for fun and we're doing it for Yogi. <laughs> Nuts. <laughs> so worth it. Yeah. Go pee. <laughs> And now Sean has returned from another urination. If you're keeping score, that's 17 urinations for Sean. Zero for Luke. With his tiny little bladder. Yeah. I have, a, I have a bit of a problem. <laughs> Maybe I should go get a finger up my butt. And then go see a doctor. <laughs> get one of the turtles. Um, oh, you want to think up in us. <laughs> Would you like to go first, or would you like me to go first? Uh, you go ahead. Wait, okay. Did I go first last time? I did. No, that's no, right. You, yeah. did. you did. No, I think you went. Because we ended with, uh, if anybody's seen my friend, you know, please, <laughs> right. please tell me. Um, I really just want to know if he's okay. <laughs> like, I'm happy with this one, but I think I could have done better. Okay, uh, you go ahead. Okay. Because if, if yours is gold, we want the gold to go last. I hope it's gold. Okay, I'll, I'll go first then. Okay. Um, it was okay. Like I think you'll like it. (laughs) (laughs) 
whatever I prove to do. Tank top, black boots, she's a mutant <laughs> and a lover too. Oh, dude. Purple hair, one eye, oh, on the green <laughs> with me fine. She got me drooling like a Zach Brand again. Cause every dude's crazy about Lee. <laughs> sort of a double joke. Yeah, it almost Lee. sounds like I'm saying Lee Lemon. Yeah. <laughs> For all you fans out there. But it is Lee Lemon, comma, man. It was just part of the backing, but it fit. <laughs> I like it. I like it. By the way, tons of respect for ZZ Top. Oh, yeah. Solid man. Definitely. Hopefully they don't sue us. You ever see them live? No. Oh, it's great. I, they were at one of the Honda things, yeah. right? <laughs> I, I like the... Yeah. <laughs> I tried to find some uh, more vocal uh, uh, samples, like quotes and stuff, and I ran out of time. So that's what you get. That's cool. Yeah. Just wait for the solo to be over. Yeah. On with it, Billy. Right? more fucking verse. <laughs> Gold one, beady eye, let's hold her poppers and stay in tonight. Knee blur, tight dress, snoo snoo on the planet express. She got me doing like that bread again. Never do it crazy about Lee. And it goes on with lots more guitar stuff. <laughs> oh, that was that was good. I, I liked it. I was. I did not feel that strongly about it. <laughs> it uh, like I was okay, and I started working on another one, but it had way too many words, and I was like, ah, yeah. So I was like, oh, let me just roll with this. <laughs> Lila, I, I liked it. Good, good. <laughs> yeah, Taranga Lila. Now let's uh, let's see what you get. Okay. Just you know, uh, disclaimer. <laughs> I slapped this together. This morning. Oh, there you went. Disclaimer. If I offend anyone, I'm not trying to sound racist. <laughs> <laughs> but it's going to happen. <laughs> Heritage, not hate. <laughs> so, so here's my parody of Two Live Crew. <laughs> <laughs> I got I to gotta lie, but I don't think I should say it. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's move on. Okay. Uh, here's... <laughs> Here's my one for uh, this week. Green snake, hello blue, nothing's better than whacking you. Lisa's mad, she says it's wrong. Got Barry White to sing a song. <laughs> that sounds awesome. <laughs> yeah, it could be better. Get too hot on you. It's a holiday. It's a holiday. It's a holiday. Whacking day, hunting snakes. Did you say I just got raped? Oh, oh. <laughs> Take it back about 30 seconds. It's a I 
I just got three. Oh. <laughs> went, I just got raped. I'm like, dude. <laughs> Mind the subject, man. <laughs> yeah, well, you know. That sounds great. What are you uh, worried about? My voice, I, I'm i not good at being on. I'm not a good singer. I'll just put it like that. <laughs> you hit the notes. Not always. <laughs> <laughs> if you listen to the beginning, it's all over the fucking place. What's the original song? Happy Days. <laughs> oh, I cannot place it. Yeah. Are you just doing theme songs now? I, I guess so. <laughs> I go where I'm inspired. That's true. <laughs> Next is going to be Spider-Man. You didn't like any of my suggestions? <laughs> <laughs> so, Well, I, I wanted to do this one, but it felt like it would be too much fucking work. And then... <laughs> and it was. <laughs> it was. But other stuff, I, uh, I try to like... Mm, I don't want to give it away because I might end up doing it later. <laughs> like, I couldn't find the right song. You know, like it, the sound of the karaoke verses were pissing me off. So, Dude, uh, I hear you. You like, know what pisses me off? When you find a karaoke version that mm, somebody sings. Yes. Oh, dude. Why are you putting that on YouTube? Blah, blah. Karaoke version. No, I'm not talking like, hey, guys, I did this karaoke song. No, I'm talking like it's the song that's a karaoke song for yeah. people to sing with. Mm-hmm. That has a vocal track. Oh yeah, I get I get what? that too. Why? It's fucking stupid. Yeah, people in there. If I may quote Sideshow Bob, I believe it's. <laughs> Sorry, I can do that. <clears throat> <laughs> it sounded like you said me hungry. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if that's what he's saying, but it sounds like it. Me go hungry. ask a um <laughs> what? was that English? <laughs> go ask um Kelsey Grammer. Um I'm good. Niles <laughs> God damn it, Niles <laughs> <laughs> That sounds so much better. <laughs> It sounds almost better than for God's sake, Styles. <laughs> oh shit! I didn't realize. <laughs> God damn it, Niles! Go pressing around in here. <laughs> God damn it, Niles! That was good. That was good. <laughs> I completely forgot. I thought that's what he said. <laughs> Anywho, <clears throat> um, yeah. Well, I need to be hitting the old dusty trail. That's disgusting. He's my brother. <laughs> <laughs> well, if he's got Taco Bell, I'm gonna be hitting it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, ah, that's a weird note to end on. Yeah. <laughs> hey, mm-hmm. Dustin. Fuck him good. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> It's your brother. What are you going to do? <laughs> My brother. <laughs> Wait, tell that story real quick and then we'll... So we talked about being at the football game. Mm. Yes, yes, yes. Take it, John. Yes, not that. Sean started giggling as the band was playing. <laughs> yes. And why did you giggle? <laughs> well, because why did why why did they do that? Is it every time they like it's a the fight song? No, no, it, that's at the end of every every fight song. Yeah. Oh, I thought they did it because they did it like two times, like it for goes, no reason. Do, 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 yeah. Okay. Well. <laughs> it went <laughs> so that's a, the note that we used to do when we were talking about a rusty trombone <laughs> which is <laughs> that's where somebody licks your asshole while they're jacking you off <laughs> <laughs> and then we always go <laughs> 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 and then what happens is every time somebody mentions the word trombone one of us dumbasses always has to go so this trombone you're talking about. <laughs> yeah. Um, is it rusty? Because <laughs> we're fucking hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> so every time it started going off, we started laughing. It was it was yes. beautiful. Did I mention I met Bruce Campbell? An episode ago. Yeah. Yeah. You still met him. 
And it's still great. So, how did he respond to the rusty trombone? Not well. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta pay extra for that, kid. <laughs> we don't have time to keep doing this, kid. <laughs> that sucked, I'm sorry. <laughs> Work on your form. Come back next year. Yeah. It, yeah, stretching out your jaw doesn't really work on radio. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm tired. And drunk. All right, let's wrap this up. Yeah. Um, hopefully we'll be back next week. Um, but you never know. World could end. We might die. Yeah. Um, I could have a sudden heart attack. You just don't know. <laughs> oh, that's coming. <laughs> or stroke. No, we've, we only recorded two episodes. So hopefully we got something sort of hoping happens. But if it doesn't, mm. we'll... We'll just do like a best of. Yeah, we're not but, going to see Kyle Kinane anymore. Yeah, we're going to go see Kyle Kinane that day, but. He fell through. Well, it fucking sold out. Who yeah. the fuck thought Kyle <laughs> Kinane would sell out? <laughs> yeah. Well, you probably did, but. Yeah. <laughs> it's good Ron stuff. Funches didn't sell out. Yeah, no, that's, that, that blows my mind. Uh, but they put two shows that night. Yeah. So, but. I don't know. Bastards. I'll check the website again and see if they added another show, but. Yeah. Either way. Uh, Beast. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Yogi. Hey. Bye, Yogi. This is the show that will not end. Episode 55? It just goes on and on, my friend. Some people started podcasting it. Not knowing what it was. And they'll just keep on podcasting forever just because. This is the pod that doesn't it end. end. It just, just goes, goes on and on, on my friend. friend. People, People started podcasting. Oh, fuck this. You don't want to know. And they'll just keep on podcasting <laughs> forever <laughs> because they <laughs> got some whalers on the moon. We carry a harpoon. <laughs> but there ain't no. <laughs> 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 but there ain't no one. So we don't talk to them. sing a whaling tune. tune. Hey! <laughs> hey, thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. Mm hmm.